Hello guys, welcome to this video. I'm going to be showing you how to use WISE motion sensors to turn on lights, uh, like kitchen lights. Not only that, specifically within a schedule. Now this works with Alexa, Google, or Siri, or anything. Pretty much you actually don't even use the applications. Um, it's pretty much done through the Smart Life app and if. So there are some things you will need, which is the lights, the smart lights or switch. Uh, you need a smart plug and you also need to have an account with IFT. If you're not familiar with these things, I would suggest you to find out how these things work on the side. Um, the logic behind it is I want my kitchen lights to be turned on at night and not during the day. And again, turned off once there's no motion detected. So to do this, we do need to launch some automations. So first, we're going to launch a start on, uh, automation like you guys will see on the screen right here. And I'm going here a little quick, but you're gonna run the device and you're gonna pick specifically uh, the smart plug. So I'm gonna put, okay, when the smart plug is on, I want my task, which is my kitchen lights to turn on. Right here on schedule, I can pick a custom time, but in this time, I'm only gonna pick night. I'm gonna put my address, uh, you know, so it knows when it's night and day, uh, and when it's a sunrise, and I'm gonna save this. Now, this is only for turning on the device. Now, I need to do another um, automation, and again, this is through the Smart uh, Life app. Um, I will do another automation to turn the lights off. So again, same thing, I will pick the smart plug. When the smart plug is turned off, I'm gonna turn off the kitchen lights and I'm gonna go again with the effective period. I'm gonna go with night, I'm gonna select the city and region, but I'm actually gonna select all day in here. I'm not gonna go with sunrise. I'm gonna select all day because if nobody's in the kitchen, I do still want my kitchen lights to turn off. So once I have this, I will go to the IFT application and I will start a new um, if this then that. Then I'm gonna search for WISE and WISE is gonna be my trigger here. I'm gonna say okay when a motion sensor detects motion uh, and here it's loading my sensors. So I'm gonna pick my kitchen sensor. When it detects motion then I'm gonna go with Smart Life and I'm gonna pick turn on. Now I want my IFT to turn on my smart plug. Um, and again, right here, I'm gonna select smart plug. And then pretty much what's gonna happen is again, if there's motion within detected with WISE, it's gonna turn on the smart plug which within the Smart Life application, if the smart plug is turned on, within it will launch that automation. And if the automation, again, if the condition of within that schedule uh, is met, then the automation will trigger. And if it's not, then it won't. Same as with Smart Life, we have to do another if for the turning off. So again, if wise, you know, uh, motion sensor detection is, uh, I guess, like no more, then we go back to Smart Life. Uh, we pretty much pick turn off device and we will pick turn off smart plug. We do the same thing over again, we name it. Now, some people might say, well, you know, I, I'm not, I don't feel too comfortable having a smart plug turning on and off every time. Honestly, if you are annoyed by the little clicking sound, you could just put the smart plug in the garage somewhere where you won't hear it. Uh, but so far, this is the only way I found out how to make my lights turn on and off using wise motion sensors. And again, uh, before I used to do just the if, and it would turn on my lights even if it's day or, you know, so this is actually a very cool integration. So I'm gonna show you guys now uh, pretty much a demonstration. So right here, as you guys can see, I installed my smart plug and I'm gonna go ahead and I'm, I'm kind of struggling here with one hand. Um, but pretty much I'm gonna see that my smart plug is turned on right now and my integrations and my if is already set and ready. 
So I'm gonna turn it off because I'm gonna walk inside the kitchen and I wanted to turn on. So right now the lights in the kitchen are off. As I'm walking in the kitchen, the motion sensor detects me. It turns on the smart plug. The smart plug puts the command and now my kitchen lights are on. Now in the same way, uh, well, I'm getting now a notification from it because I, I chose to run a notification. You could turn that off because it does get annoying. Uh, my motion sensor is here. So again, it triggered it uh, successfully. Now, if I sit back here and just wait for the motion sensor to uh, stop motion, then it'll just turn off the lights. And at the same time, it's going to turn off my smart plug. So I hope this helped guys. This really helped me. Um, please feel free to subscribe. And if you have any questions about your own automations, I'll be more than happy to help. Uh, again, thank you so much and have a great day.